Shalom. All praise to Yahweh, Bashan Yahweh, Double honors to the elders and apostles of Great Millstone. And peace and salutations to the brothers that's out there pushing the truth and love and sincerity and the love of the gospel. All right. Um, back at it again with another uh, quick hit. Uh, just want to really uh, bring up uh, one scripture. You know, just want to make a quick, well, I got some downtime. Make a quick, uh, make a quick point right quick. Um, so this is, uh, basically, this is going to be our, um, wisdom and knowledge and stability of our time. This is, says, uh, this is Ecclesiastics chapter 11, verse 18. It says, wisdom is better than weapons of war. All right. So it says wisdom is better than weapons of war. And I was start talking about is, you know, when we out here, you know, Excuse me. When we're out here, you know, in this in, 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 Jacob, in times of Jacob's trouble, you know, we're gonna we're gonna have to rely on our, you know, our in, our uh, the wisdom we got being in this truth, you know, to help us survive out there, you know, in the wilderness, all right? Because you know, if you if you call yourself a man of the Lord, you're not gonna take that chip, right? You're not gonna take that chip. You're not gonna um. You're not gonna basically be out here rioting. You know, if you're in your right mind, you know, if the Lord gives you the knowledge, wisdom, and understanding to, to let you know this is not your fight, you know, because me, myself, I'm not going to be out there rioting, man. That's just, that's just waiting, that's just basically waiting for them to get you in a concentration camp, right? Because that's where all them rioters are going to go, either being shot and killed on sight, or they're going to be put in, they're going to be placed in a concentration camp, all right? But the scripture says wisdom shall, it's wisdom is better than weapons of war, all right? That's also talking about, man, even, uh, you know, all these martial law troops that's going to flood, that's going to come in like a flood. Hey, no matter how much ammo, no matter how, what type of weapons you have, you're not going to be able to fight against the whole martial law troops or fight or, or, or put up a fight against the martial law troops. All right. That's not that's not you. That's not that's not, it's not your time to do that. All right. That's why it says that's why it says um, uh, in the scriptures, it says uh, vengeance is the Lord's. All right. We have to wait upon him. To come back and then give us them, uh, give us some spiritual powers, you know, for um, to give us our spiritual powers, so we can um, so we can fight against this man. All right, we can't do it up, up on our own, man. That's that's going without faith. All right, everybody know uh, all the brothers should not know about uh, Isaiah, you know, uh, um, about uh, Isaiah thirty three, or is it six and thirty three? You know where it says um. It says wisdom and knowledge shall be the stability of our time. All right, I believe it's six and thirty-three. You know, but it says wisdom and knowledge shall be the stability of our time. All right, and what's the word stability mean, man? It means stable. All right, it basically means it's gonna keep you sane while you're out there in that wilderness. All right, because that's that's the only thing you have to rely on. You know, by relying on the wisdom and knowledge, it is is like relying on Yahweh Shah Himself. All right, because you. Are, you're having faith in Yahweh Shah to feed you, all right? That's when the ultimate, that's going to be the ultimate faith tester, all right? To see who's really down for Yahweh Shah and who's not, all right? Are you going to wind up getting that chip and saying, you know, fuck the truth, I'm, I'm still an Israelite, I can just go ahead and, I can go ahead and, uh, um, I'm going, I'm not, I'm not, I might, I might not be saved, but I'm going to still get the kingdom, I'm going to still be an, um, I'm going to still be an Israelite, I ain't going to be suffering no more. True? You know, you're not going to suffer no more, but hey, you're going to be uh, having an everlasting shame. All right. So, you know, you, 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 you're you choosing, you're choosing being part of that second death. All right. And the scripture said, man, it is a fearful thing to fall in the hands of the living power. All right. And you're going to, and you, and, and you knowing not the chip is, uh, is not to be taken and you taking it anyways, man, you're going to be beaten with many stripes. Right. That means the Lord's going to fuck you up even more. All right. Because when the, the people that he's coming back, true, they don't know, but they had a chance to know and they rejected it. You knew and understand and understood that that chip was bad and and, and went back and still and, and still got it. All right, so you're gonna be required more. And you're gonna be beaten with many stripes. All right, but I ain't you know I ain't want to make a video just rambling on. I just want to you know 
uh, pulled that scripture out. It was on my spirit, you know, do a little quick hit and, um, you know, just elaborate on it a little bit. But, um, your brother, stay encouraged, um, continue in the faith, you know, meet, meet, meet the requirements that is required of you, you know, which is the two sit downs a week or more, you know, if you can do more, you can, Hey, if you can do more, do more. You know, Elder Elder Tahar, Apostle Tahar just said two sit downs at the least, man. You know, me myself, I'm gonna try to do more. All right, because I have downtime like this where I can make a, a sit down and just like boom, boom, boom. You know, it might be a, a scripture or two, you know, but still, you know, something is better than nothing. All right. I rather I rather I rather be on fire, you know, than be lukewarm. All right. And it's all and it's all for the love for you from Yahweh Bashan Yahweh Shah, you know. Cause that's that's what, that's what required of us, all right. But with that, I want to say all praises to Yahweh, Bashim Yahweh Shah. Uh, uh, double honors to the elders and the apostles of Great Millstone, and peace and salutations to the brothers that's out there, pushing the truth in love and sincerity and the love of the gospel, all right. That's pushing the truth in all sincerity, you know, in all love. That's out there hot, all right. So with that, I want to say shalom.